So I was in San Diego the other day with uh, Mayor Gloria of San Diego and uh, Lindsay Horvath. Oh my God, we are so lucky to have her as the head of the Board of Supervisors. Uh, I was so delighted to work with her as the Mayor of West Hollywood. Um, we work together on, on making sure that when someone is in crisis, when someone is having a mental health crisis, that, that it, we don't always call on the police as the first responders. And, and the challenge, uh, you know, some of these challenges are deeply intertwined. I think when people start to feel that the quality of their life has slipped below their parents and they have profound worries of the future for their kids, they start to entertain, all too many start to entertain any demagogue who comes along promising that they alone can fix it. <laughs> Mayor Rex Richardson, um, you know, and uh, Antonio will back me up on this, maybe the toughest job around being the mayor of a big city. Uh, you know, I was in San Diego the other day with uh, Mayor Gloria of San Diego, and uh, he was telling me how he met the president recently, and Joe Biden told him, you've got a really tough job. I remember being in Calexico and uh, having a, a young Latino roundtable and meeting these incredible young people who had been told to leave the Imperial Valley because they wanted to get ahead, they needed to leave, and, and they did leave, and they got a good education, they came back because they wanted to give back. And they talked with me about the struggles they were facing and gave me a tour of Calexico. And on that tour, we stopped at a transportation depot. It must have been 100 degrees out. He got up every day at 1 a.m. Uh, he walked through the port of entry. Never knew how long it was going to take, depending on the conditions of the port of entry. So he had to be up really early. Got to the bus depot where I met him. Got on a bus to a farm. Worked for eight hours off in 100 degree heat then went back on a bus to where I met him, then went back across the border. He was lucky to have an hour or two with his family before he had to go to sleep and wake up and repeat. He was lucky to do it. This may have been the hardest working person I've ever met. Leave the Imperial Valley because they wanted to get ahead, they needed to leave, and, and they, that, that it, we don't always call on the police as the first responders. And I'm promising that they alone can fix it. <laughs> Mayor Rex Richards. Lindsay Horvath, oh my God, we are so lucky to have her. So I was in San Diego the other day with uh, Mayor Gloria of San Diego and uh, the Mayor of West Hollywood. Um, we worked together on, on making sure, you know, round table and meeting these incredible young people who had been told to leave. And the challenge, uh, you know, some of these challenges are deeply intertwined. I remember being in Calexico and uh, having a, a young that did leave and they got a good education, they came back because they wanted to give back. And they talked their life had slipped below their parents and they have profound worries of the future for their kids. Me about the struggles they were facing and gave me a tour of Calexico and on that tour we stopped flying. I think when people start to feel that the quality of the, he was telling me how he met the president recently and Joe Biden told him, you've got a really tough job. That when someone is in crisis, when someone is having a mental health crisis, maybe the toughest job around being the mayor of a big city. Uh, you know, they start to entertain, all too many start to entertain any demagogue who comes to the transportation depot. It must have been 100 degrees out. He got up every sin. Um, you know, and uh, Antonio will back me up on this. 